Breaking news, my lovely, wonderful people. APC Knox Governor Akewe um, Ademola Adeleke over rising cases of Inap going on in Oshun State. Recently, you know, wicked and evil people has been going around to make, you know, to make the state unbearable and um, they've been doing all kinds of things. And it's really very, very confusing if you ask me because people are really wondering what exactly is going on here? You know, how did this happen and what exactly is going on? You know, the governor of Oshun State is having real serious issue with people because um, APC says the people have been um, end up in the state and it's causing a lot of reaction. Anyway, my lovely, wonderful people, this is happening and you cannot begin to imagine some of the things that are going on as APC is pointing at the governor with regards to the issue of what is going on. Please don't forget to give us a thumbs up, like us, share, subscribe. APC knocks governor Adeleke over rising cases of kidnapping in the state. The All Progressive Congress in Oshun State has called on Governor Demola Deliki to stop treating with levity security issues affecting the state, that they have never had it like this before. The party also noted that it was worried over the insecurity in Oshun, particularly before, during and after the general election across the country. The party, in a statement by sitting chairman, Lawa on Monday also recall that no fewer than 30 members of the opposition APC members were allegedly killed by talks reportedly sponsored by the People's Democratic Party PDP in the state. Why insisting that Governor Ademola Deleke is not getting it right in securing the lives of the residents and the people of Oshun and their property. The party lamented that in the past weeks, specifically on Wednesday and Friday, two kidnapping incidents occurred along the Oshogbo Road. As of the one, as of the time of making the statement, with the exception exception of a woman who whose relatives were was also was. Uh, was also secured by the police on Sunday. The victim said, till now, some other persons are still in captivity. A, a caring governor would have either condemned the two kidnapping incidents in his territory within two to three days or rushing out, rushing back from Abuja to protect the people of his state and ensure that security officers in his state are doing their duty di diligently. It is saddening that as I speak, Governor Demola Deleke has not made a comment condemning this evil and all the murder credited unto him going on in the state by this APC by this PDP talks. APC members have been at the end where they've been receiving this evil and nobody has said anything that hap that is happening so far. In the last four months of his administration, things have not gone well in the state. His handling on show state affair has shown that gov the governance of the state is not a tea party, which is the reason why it is not the best arrangement to make the state a laboratory for a green horn in management of the affair of human beings and resources. The acting state APC chairman hinted, Oshun APC justified its claim of toggery activities being on the rise by narrating how Governor Demola Deleke denied being attacked by thugs only for them to be arraigned in court. Recalling that Nigerian police Oshun Command has disclosed that a female passenger among those adopted on Friday along the Oshubo has been released. YMC, the Oshun Police Command spokesperson also disclosed that efforts to secure the release of other adoptees has commenced, but the governor has not responded like he should. So this is what is happening, my wonderful people. The Ademola Deleke is being accused, you know, is being accused of not uh, caring for the people. 
is being, you know, is being accused for not caring for the people, for doing things that, you know, uh, you know, that are, that is against, you know, the people of Oshun, that he has not gone there to look after them. And, you know, uh, he's in Abuja, why people in the state have been kidnapped and all that. And he's not, they said he has not rushed back. So um, APC in the state is really scrutinizing every single thing Ademola Adeleke does. And um, they said the incident of, you know, the incident of uh, kidnapping has risen, you know, during, uh, before, during, and even after the elections. And they expect, according to APC, lamenting that the governor will wake up to responsibility, gear of security agencies to come to their senses and begin to work tirelessly for the people. Ademola apparently is in Abuja and he said he's working for the people. Um, you know, if he, if he really is number one and the people has given him a mandate, he should have rushed down to ensure their safety and security rather than staying back there and having not said anything in the face of all that is going on currently right now. Okay. I said with all that is going on, it should have done better, you know, and this is what is happening. So my wonderful people, you can see exactly what is going on. You can see that people have made up their mind on the path they want to tow or they want to go in order for them to be able to get whatever they think they could. And um, they feel that Ademola is not looking after the people of Oshun State very well like he should, that he should have done more. Okay, in securing and protection of lives and property, they said that Demola is not doing well. So they are coming out now to really accuse him and to put it out there that Ademola Deleke, you know, has not looked after the people. He's gone on now to, you know, to do other things and it's really, really tiring. It's, it doesn't really make sense. And um, they said if he really cares for the people, you know, it's just accusation. Okay, accusation upon accusation, mounting up and building up, you know, in all of this. So it is what it is. It is what it is. And it is important that we all understand that, you know, Nigerians, we have to really sincerely ensure that every single one of us, okay, are doing everything we possibly can to put Nigeria right back on track. So at the end of the day, this nation can move forward. Okay, so at the end of the day, the nation can move forward. Everything we can and we should that we could possibly do to put Nigeria, you know, in the place that it should be. We all have to ensure we do these things, you know, and make sure that people are not kept down and left, you know, in a place where it's not right. Please don't forget to give us a thumbs up, like us, share, subscribe. God bless. Have a fantastic day. Bye for now.